everybody, we're back. My first guest is a uh, hilarious comedian. Beginning tomorrow, you can see him on Comedy Central in the season premiere of Chappelle's show. Please welcome Dave Chappelle. <laughs> You get the love. You get the love every time. You get the love. Man, all because of you, man. Thanks no, for having no. Me it's again. good to have you here. It's good to be back. Yeah. Yeah, man. Life's good. Life is uh, beautiful. Life is beautiful. That's yeah. such a nice sentiment. Yeah, it is. No, let me ask you. <laughs> let me ask you what you've been up to lately. I mentioned that that story uh, about um, you know Martha Stewart and Martin Luther King Day, and you know people thinking yeah. that she's trying to pander. <laughs> How do you spend uh, Martin Luther King Day? You know, it's funny. Nowadays, I, I'll celebrate it. Uh, usually just by watching MTV or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, thank God for Martin Luther King, because before integration, uh, the radio sucked. <laughs> it's everything, kind of, yeah. Everything on the radio was like bum 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 bum. Mr. Sandman. <laughs> lollipop, lollipop, oh. That's party music. Yeah. Actually, that was the tape at my last party. So. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, Club hits of the 50s. But, uh, no, so a special time. That was a good day. You had a good day yesterday. You hung out, enjoyed life. Do you, I know that you are a smoker. Yeah. And you, uh, and I'm curious, living in Manhattan right now, what do you do? Because it, where can you smoke these days? It seems like it's a difficult situation in, in Manhattan for smokers. Nowhere. You can't, it's in fear. Look, the other night, right? Me and my buddies went to a strip club. My friends were getting married. Mm -hmm. And what better way to celebrate a marriage? <laughs> <laughs> right. So we go to this strip club, and I'm, I'm smoking a cigarette in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I figure I'm famous. Maybe I'll get away with it. <laughs> so the stripper comes up. Stripper. She says, sir, could you put that cigarette out? I'm going to have you thrown out of here. You have your gonorrhea-infested vagina in my face. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like... You started it. I'm just smoking, man. It's not fair. <laughs> I'm telling you, Conan, it was a crazy... Uh, can't, you can't move on from that. No, you, just can't... <laughs> you can't just keep talking after that. You gotta give a man a time to recover. <laughs> All right, so what happened then after you got that line off? How did she respond? Oh, she, she, was, <laughs> she was cool about yeah, it. Yeah. As cool as a person can be about that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and uh -huh. over the course of the night, you know, my buddies were drinking. And, you know, when you drink, you see things. I literally, this is... <laughs> that's if you drink a lot. That's if you drink, you drink a lot. drink a lot, Dave. You well, see things. Yeah, okay, fine. I drink a lot. <laughs> and right. uh, I think... I, I met the devil, which sounds crazy. You saw the devil? At a strip club. Right. It was weird, because he sat at our table. Mm -hmm. He didn't say, I'm the devil. Right. But you know how somebody sits near you and is like, I don't like this person's energy. Right. And I guess I had a little tipsy, so it just kind of came out. I was like, oh, man. I said, like, you are the devil. Right. right. <laughs> and I think he heard me. So he's like, yes, I am the devil. Wow. He had the scratchy voice. Right. And uh, in case you were wondering, he was white, no offense. I'm just telling you what I saw. I'm just telling you what I saw. Okay, he's just describing the man, the devil, it, it turns out is white. That's... Well, I was thrown off. I was like, well, I thought you'd be like bright red with horns or something <laughs> like this. And he says, I come in different forms. So, you know, I'm asking, like, so you come as a black guy mm -hmm. sometimes, too? And he was like, no, that, that would be too dangerous. I don't have a... <laughs> I don't have ID. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> we talked a little bit. You talked to the devil for a while? Just a little bit. Uh -huh. But when I was leaving, I saw him outside, and I was catching a cab, so I was like, well, the devil's white. Can you hail a cab for me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the devil was actually cool. He says, why don't we split one? Oh, that's nice. So we get in the cab. I say, it's going to be two stops. I'm going to Brooklyn. The devil said, I'm going to hell. The cab driver says, no Brooklyn. <laughs> <laughs> so that really happened to you, huh? Yeah, like, yeah, it was last week. Uh -huh. 
Yeah. Well, now I believe. Now you're you're touring constantly. You're well, touring all the time. All the time. Where where, where you been lately? Where you go? Like uh, where, you was, go to some nice cities. I was in San Francisco. That's a great city. Beautiful city. Good town for comedy, right? Mm -hmm. So after the show is late, and I asked the guy who's like the promoter, I'm like, is there somewhere I can get something to eat? He's like, look, man, it's late. There's one restaurant open. Uh, I don't know if you're comfortable with this, but it's a gay restaurant. <laughs> gay restaurant? Yeah. So we go to the place. The place is called The Squat and Gobble. <laughs> I'm not thinking, you can look it up in the phone book. They're probably happy they're getting a plug right now. Yeah. <laughs> But I just feel like it's so weird. Like, what is, you I know? I even know there were, there are, I guess there are gay, there's gay bars, so there'd be gay restaurants. Right, yeah. but it's like, if you ever, like, I'm hungry, it's like, well, what do you want, Chinese, Italian, or gay? And I'm like, what is gay food? <laughs> now, you're shooting your show, Chappelle's show, yeah. all over the city. Yeah. Shooting it all over the place. Thank you. You shoot, you exploit every part of New York. Yeah, yeah, we, we do a lot of the show. Actually, we shoot the main part of the show in Harlem which is beautiful now. Have you been up there recently? Yeah, we actually shot something uh, a little while ago there. It's, uh, it's very nice. Yeah, yeah. they're fixing it up, which actually you think black people would be happy about, but it makes them mad. It makes them mad? Yeah, because it's not like they're fixing it up for black people. You know, white people, the white people are coming. <laughs> so they'll freak out, like, you know, when things that you think would make them happy, like, oh, they're fixing the school! Damn! <laughs> <laughs> they paving the streets! No! <laughs> We're out what of are here. we gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Life is like that, you know. I mean, I've lived in a lot of. I used to live in in the hood, as they call it. Me too. Yeah, it's very. <laughs> I thought I'd try it. Well, no, nah, see. <laughs> I stick out a little bit. See, Conan, you're brave. A lot of uh, white people are afraid to walk through Harlem and stuff late at night, and you got to remember that the. Black people could be just afraid of you as you are of them, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> white dudes walking through Harlem, he's like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna get mugged or beat up. And the black people thinking, oh my God, it's a cop. He's not fooling us. Everyone act natural. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's tense. <laughs> yeah. That's the problem. He might look like Conan O'Brien. <laughs> I know a cop. That's a popular see. look up there, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the Hi, everybody. How are you? <laughs> They're selling Conan O'Brien dolls in Harlem. They go like hotcakes. I actually have a Conan O'Brien doll. You do? It's a voodoo doll. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's working. I don't hate My it. ass is killing me. The, uh, <laughs> the new... We've done it again. We've done it again. The new season of Chappelle's show premieres tomorrow night at 10.30 on Comedy Central. Very funny show, as you know. Make sure that you see it, 10.30 at night. Dave Chappelle, always oh, great. Oh, Jerry Orbach coming up to take a break. We'll be right back.